Hmm. Here is a one month human embryo um, model shown with the embryo inside the uterus. Let's just kind of orient ourselves to a few of the things we're already familiar with. This structure, of course, is the myometrium of the uterus. Here is the ovary. Here is the infundibulum of the uterine tube, right here. A couple of structures we haven't talked about. Here is the ovarian ligament. And here we find the broad ligament. And this is represented pretty well on that model. Now, back here, <coughs> we find in the cavity of the uterus, here's the embryo itself, and this is the fetal integument, including the developing amnion. Here is the chorion, or the, uh, actually at this stage, it's the uh, fetal contribution to the placenta, this gray region right here. Over here, we find the endometrium lining the uterus, and in this region right here, the red associated with this gray is the maternal contribution to the placenta. Okay. This is um, the five month uh, now fetus, looks like a human, uh, also found in the uh, amniotic sac. This pink line right here is what represents the amnion right here, the fetal integument, including the amnion. Here we have the endometrium, the red, all the way around the outside. But in this region, between here and here, we have what is representing the placenta. The gray is the fetal contribution to the placenta, including uh, chorionic villi. And over here, we have the maternal contribution to the placenta. If I turn this little guy, we will see that there is an umbilical cord. And um, if I kind of turn this model a little more, we'll see that there is an ovary and infundibulum with fimbri and a uterine tube. And here we have the ovarian ligament represented. I'll put him back in and we'll be set.